plenty of height. And now West Bromwich Albion Wall. Nani! Hernandez! Manchester United in the lead! In the blink of an eye! Hernandez coaching! United in front! Just the start that he wanted. This is Mark Antoine Fortuny for West Bromwich Albion. Brunt comes racing in, and somehow the ball has stayed out. Nani, Shuri with the slip and could be punished. Berbatov, it's Nani, it's 2 0. West Bromwich Albion ripped apart after Shuri slip, and Manchester United take full advantage. West Bromwich Albion, the leading team in the West Midlands coming into this weekend, sixth position in the Barclays Premier League. Roberto Di Matteo, though, is not one to get carried away. Touching on here as Choi tries to link up with Fortuna, and Choi has got the free kick. Yeah, the assistant gave it, I'm not convinced that Mike Jones saw it. And the assistant flagged immediately. Anderson just trying to apply a little bit of pressure, beaten by the, the change of pace here from Choi. And he certainly had a good handful of the West Brom midfielder shot there. Tamash, Shana, Choi, Fortune, and Olsen have all ventured forward. Fight in by Brunt and Patrice Everett. Well, it's gone in. The goal has been given. A clip off Patrice Everett. Van der Sar tried to keep it out, but all in vain. And West Brom and Jalbian are back in business. Well, it's a horrible ball for Manchester United to defend. Chris Brunt just smashes it into the mix of the front post. To be fair to the assistant on the far side, he gave it immediately. It's Joy. Trying to skip his way through, and Everett stood strong. Real belief again about West Bromwich Albion now. Sharma. Hara. Van der Sar having to parry the ball away at his near post. That's Choi looking for Fortune. Now it's Morrison. Always stretching. Chris Brunt to collect here for West Bromwich Albion. And Van der Sar to catch it. No, he doesn't. Choi scores! West Bromwich Albion have turned this right around. It's 2-2. A horror moment for Edwin van der Sar. Yeah, absolutely inexplicable, this one. I mean, Chris Brunt did well to, to hang it up, but the ball's in the air a long time. Edwin van der Sar's under no real pressure, and somehow it gets through his gloves.